Welcome to the introduction to the five main sections of the AutoChartist platform. What you're looking at right now is the online version of the platform whereby AutoChartist is presenting five different sections to give you insight into emerging patterns, completed patterns, patterns that have recently alerted, the chart pattern itself and the quality indicators that accompany it, as well as your search criteria section where your general and specific searches are kept. Let's take a look at each one of these five sections, starting with, in the very center, the chart pattern section. The chart pattern section itself is probably where most people find themselves first going to because it gives us the visual of the chart pattern itself and this is where most people will begin to assess whether the pattern is something they want to trade. They will take some aesthetic readings of the pattern in terms of whether it looks like a quote-unquote good pattern. But this is probably just one of many areas that can be examined in order to interpret whether this might be a potential setup and even then a potential trade. The chart pattern center section is divided into not just the image of the chart pattern but also the quality indicators. The quality indicators are a very important component of the auto chartist alert because each alert will give you not only the symbol, the interval, and the pattern itself, but when the pattern ended, the length of the pattern, the direction, or in the case of an emerging pattern, the potential direction of the break, the overall quality, followed by the three components that make up the overall quality, the initial trend, the uniformity, the clarity, the breakout reading, which is specific only to completed patterns, and then the forecast area, which again is specific to completed patterns. So let's discuss completed and emerging patterns now. The two columns, completed patterns on the left, emerging patterns on the right, are essentially the way AutoChartists will present patterns that are still developing and have not yet broken the support or resistance of the pattern meaning the emerging pattern. This is a more proactive look at what could be a potential setup and eventual trade. Remember, whether you're looking at the completed pattern section or the emerging pattern section, these are not all trades. This is not a system. This is rather a chart pattern scanning, identification, and alert platform that will act in many ways as a trading partner in your trading room. So if emerging patterns are a proactive look at price action as it trades within the support and resistance of the pattern, completed patterns then are when price action has broken either the support or resistance of the pattern. As in this case of the pedant which has broken the downtrend line resistance. Notice accompanying this break is the breakout reading as well as the forecast area, the prices of which are listed here and the shaded area which represents those prices. Moving on to the pattern alert section to the right here, this is where you can toggle on and off the audio alert, which you just heard, as well as be notified of new patterns that have been found. Another very helpful section is the time zone drop down menu which will give you the ability to have the alerts reflect which time zone you are in. Let's move on to a very important section which is the chart pattern search and the Fibonacci pattern search area. While we will have future video dedicated to customizing your own search, this is the area where you can specify or utilize the default searches that are built in the AutoChartist platform or customize your very own based upon time frame, based upon the actual pattern, and a number of other criteria. The same can be said for the Fibonacci patterns. 
So this section here will allow you to take a look at different groupings. For example, we're looking at the intraday forex scan. And you can see this is a mix of different intervals, 15, 30, 60, 240 minute time frames. So of these four intraday time frames, I'm scanning across multiple forex pairs. However, if I want to specify a particular pair and or a specific particular time frame or interval, that can be done with a custom search. And as you can see here, this is a dollar yen custom search. So these five sections of the AutoChartist platform all have a place within your overall chart analysis. They all become areas that you will become very familiar with. And in the very beginning, understand what kind of information each section is providing and therefore you'll be able to get the most benefit from this platform.